Okay, let's take a general walk around this uh, Alpha 156 1.8 uh, Twin Spark. And then we'll get down to the nitty gritty on it. Alloy wheels, obviously, the nice telephone dial alloys. A bit difficult to uh, really go into detail on the body at the moment, purely because it's uh, um, it's so wet and dark and miserable. We'll give it our best shot. Okay, looks fairly nice around the front end. A couple of bigger stone chips in the bonnet just there. So to excuse my cold, I'm afraid. Um, we've got a little bit of scuffing that's gone down to the primer just here on the near side front bumper corner. Uh, screen on the near side looks pretty good. No problems there. It's got the usual, um, what these alphas tend to do on the bottoms of the doors. It started to bubble up just around here. There's a lot of dirt in there actually, so it's, that's why it looks blacker than it is. Uh, but it started to bubble up in an area around there, around there, around there, on the near side uh, front door bottom. Not uncommon on these. Uh, but aside from that, the near side looks pretty good. It is Rosso red, so it's obviously the flat red. Um, I will say that the boot lid seems to be a very, very slightly different shade of red. Um, in fact, the boot lid is closer to what it should be really. I think probably when it's dry, we'll give it a polish and that should bring it back to, um, to an all round matching color. Can't guarantee it, but it looks like that's the, the case, I suspect, just because where it's, uh, um, it is the flat red, it's, it's oxidized very, very slightly. Same goes for the roof, as you can probably detect a very slight colour difference between there and there. And I suspect that uh, this on the door frame is the um, is the more correct of the uh, of the colours. I've seen this before on these alphas. Carrying on round. Uh, that's all pretty good around the rear end. And down the, one thing I can't see on it is any parking dinks or dents, which is quite nice on these because they don't have rubbing strips. Let's put the badge back. Obviously the, the boot lock is underneath that, that's why you can move it. Um, it looks pretty free of parking dinks and stuff like that. Difficult to be absolutely sure because it's wet, but I think that's the case. Um, yeah, once again, it all looks to be quite nice down the offside. Yes, as, I, as I've mentioned before, I think this is the uh, closer to the correct colour, this darker red here, and I think perhaps the uh, the bonnet needs to be repolished, which we will do. Um, yeah, in fact, if you look all the way down the offside, it's it's a slightly darker uh, darker red, which is correct. Um, it's not horribly obvious, but I think a polish will will bring it back up to. Uh, uh, back up to the same colour, as I say, I can't absolutely guarantee it, but uh, uh, I think that's more likely than, than not to be the case. But obviously, it's got to be dry for us to do that. Uh, screen is nice, no problems there. Um, so, really, apart from that bubbling on the near side front door bottom, the bodywork is really good on this one. What's that? Is that a chip? Ooh, a bit of dirt. Okay, internally. Once again, nice up together car. Could do with a slightly better valley than thus far had, but it's only just come into us. Uh, needs a good vacuum or anything else. What have we got here? Driver's seat with the nice Alfa Romeo badges on. A um, little bit of slight wear on the uh, driver's seat bolster there, but uh, hasn't gone through. It's just a couple of loose threads and things like that. Passenger seat's good, it's got the sports seats and stuff in it. Um, dash is nice. Everything works, as I say, everything does what it should. Let's have a look in the back. 
um, apart from a mark here on the um, offside rear seat base, which is probably chocolate by the look of it. Um, the rear is quite good as well, it's got rear headrests. That's about it. As I say, my name is Simon. You can reach me on 0771 906 9353 or in the office on 0118 946 3352 if you've got any uh, queries or items you want to discuss. End.